Hello, my name is Pastor Loretta Yodeji of Show Jesus Power Ministry. Uh, many times um, some people may be troubled by these things they call devils and demons and witches and wizards and the powers of the night and powers of darkness. Now this video is to teach you how to curtail, control, tame and dismiss them from your environment, your home, your life and your affairs. This video is to teach you or this video yeah, it's to teach you and we'll teach you how to bind and cast out and uproot every unwanted power, spirit roaming around your house, your family and your affairs or uh, whatever it is you're doing. It's taking back control, taking back power. You being the driver of your vehicle via the Holy Spirit. Remember, remember Jesus Christ is our rock and he has given us power to tread upon serpents and scorpions and everything else and I exhaust itself against the name of God. Uh, Jesus has given us power. We, Genesis 1, have dominion over our waters, birds in the air, fish in the sea and everything that creeps on the face of the earth. The Bible says that the heavens and the heavens belongs to the Lord. The earth he has given to the sons of men. So we are to take authority over our head. The Bible says that, what is it about men that you, you know, visit them every morning? What is it about men? God loves us. He says he has made us a little lower than the angels, which means that ha, we have got authority after the angels. His angels are man, man, before all those things. We have authorities to tread upon them. To command the Bible says in the book of Matthew, chapter 18, verse 18, Verily I say unto you, whatsoever ye bind on it shall be bound in heaven, and whatsoever ye lose on it shall be loosed in heaven. We have the power to do that. And this video is to teach you how to take control of your environment, of your family, of your children, of everything that concerns you, uh, and subjecting them. You know, take control, take control of everything and any power that is obstructing, you know, subject them under the uh, power of God. Put them under your feet. Trample upon them. You know. So, uh, how do we go? We've already read it in the Bible. Matthew 18, 18. Bind. Rebuke. Cast out. Lose. Whatsoever you bind on it is bound in heaven. So, uh, now we're going to bind on it and it's bound in heaven. Whatsoever you lose on it is losing heaven. What does that mean? It means that when the powers around you or they're disturbing you or they're somewhere just somewhere uh, you bind them. You chain them. Binding them means Arresting them with supernatural powers that render them impotent and uh, uh, useless and uh, non-active, and then you cast them out into like uh, some supernatural pit or some supernatural fire, and then you lose them. Wherever it is they are hanging, just lose them out and send them away. You know, and it's powerful. It does work in the spiritual supernatural realm. The Bible says that there's power in the tongue. We have to power our tongue of life and death whatsoever we say Matthew 7 7 ask and it shall be given knock and it shall be opened seek and ye shall find whatsoever you ask John 14 14 that it will come to pass as long as you ask the name of Jesus Christ whatsoever this supernatural realm is a realm of of a command words it's a the words have power words have magnetic force especially if you know how to utilize your supernatural skill power and understanding from christ you know so whatsoever you say it's like a magnet cast out is out bind this bind lose rebuke come against take authority break chain them they are chained bind them bound them and guide them Oh my God, I'm just saying there is power in our words. There's power in the tongue. Say it. Call upon me and I will answer you. Jesus! And immediately, you know, you know, you know when you are in a terrible situation and you don't know and you just feel something, you say, Jesus! 